Right. Oh, let me explain. <laughs> this week has been the most expensive week of my life. I'm not exaggerating. I did add it all up. It, it's quite incredible, really. Uh, on one hand, it's terrifying. Very irresponsible. I mean, I should be putting money towards practical things like a mortgage. But on the other hand, it's very nice to be able to, to, to work, to, to earn it. It's very nice. And yeah, I can't. I don't want to sound like an arrogant twat, but it's just yeah. It's I, I'm 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 quite happy. But anyway, enough of that crap. So, what what why have I brought that? Is basically what the question is. This is truck number seven, and I think I mentioned it in the past several times. I wanted to do a recovery truck, and a friend of mine scanning a day for selling this one. Basically, he bought it new, uh, and I never did anything with it. So he opened it up, had a quick look, put it all back together, or put it all back in. I had a quick check when it arrived, just to make sure, and it, as far as I can tell, it's all there. But all the unique stuff is there. I might be missing some generic stuff, I can't tell. But as far as I can tell, it's all there and sealed, so I, you know, I paid a lot less than new for it. Still a lot, but anyway. This is truck number seven. Now, I'm not going to use that cab. Um, nothing against Volvos. They just don't really do anything for me, um, as you can tell. Bit of a Scania fan. But I'm not putting a Scania on it, <laughs> okay? I've got something else cool in the pipe work for it. I've, got to, I've still got to pay for it and, and actually get it here. But I've got something very cool. So I'm, all I'm going to do is a cab swap, basically. And I'm going to obviously keep the chassis and the body and all that as it is. So that's the plan, all right? That's truck number seven. I'm not going to say what the cab is yet. You probably have to wait till September before it arrives. But, um, yes. Um, the other huge news, which is the reason why this is the most expensive week of uh, expensive week of my life, is I bought a crane. Oh, yes. I have gone out and bought a hydraulic crane from Toucan Hobby. It cost an absolute fortune. And it, you only buy something really expensive, and after you make the deal, you get a, an initial mixture of regret, fear, and excitement all into one. It's really weird, and I had that for like three hours. It was I was quite on, on edge, really. But afterwards, I sort of sat down and went, well, I was going to buy it eventually anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I, I could afford it now. Why not buy it now? So yeah, that's on the way. It's uh, ready. It's a uh, ready to run, assembled and painted one. I don't want to build it myself. I'm not quite at that level yet. It'd be a little bit cheaper to buy it in bits, but I think I just thought no, I'll, I'll buy it ready to run, and, and, and when it arrives, of course, when it arrives, I'll do a video on it. Um, but that's going to go on the back of the S series T cab, which I mentioned before, which is technically truck number six. That one is going to be. It's not going to be an eight-wheeler anymore. I've changed my mind. I'm going to base it on this. So this is uh, owned by a local company, DNF Super Cranes. And as you can see, it's just an extended six-wheeler truck. So I'm basically going to base the chassis and, and put the crane on the back like that one. Obviously, mine will be an S-series. And it will be uh, it will be XT spec. So it will be an XT bumper and XT mirrors. I've spoken to Pedro about that. He hasn't finished making those parts yet. Um, but as soon as he's finished them, I'll buy a set off of him. So that's that. And the other truck, which is the DAF, which is the chassis here. Uh, as you can see, I've got the middle axle in. I've got the servo in for the steering. The airbags work. I've tested them. So that one's going well. I had a quote for the cab. Um, I am going to buy it, but because of the crane purchase, I haven't got any money left at the minute. So I've had to push that back until next month after payday. Um, actually, you know, it's not that like I haven't got any money left. It's just I don't want to dig into my savings anymore. So I'll wait till I get paid. That's all. So I'll order that when it arrives, when I get paid, and then that'll be the DAF on the way and the cab for this thing on the way, and then that's the next three trucks. So it's the mid steer lift six by two DAF, the Scania S XT. 6x4 extended with a high ab crane and this with a new cab on it so yeah quite exciting expensive also my dad's brought a beer unit which is actually being delivered to me so i can fit it in his long line so we've got cornwall truck show next weekend um 
and then after that I'll have his long line here to, to rewire it and of course then I'm going to crack on with my curtain cider trailer so these three trucks will be I'll do updates on that when big parts arrive like when the cabs arrive and when the crane arrives but I won't start building them yet I want to get the curtain cider done or at least make a decent amount of progress on it for the rest of this year so after the Cornwall truck show next week I'm going to bring the, the curtain cider here I'll crack on with it and I'll make some videos on that so yeah there won't be a video next week as you can probably you might have noticed I'm trying to do a video every Saturday I won't if I haven't got anything to film but I will try my best because I quite like that it's like a little update quite regular um, but I'll um, there won't be a video next week because I'll be at the truck show the video the next one will be the all of the show and then after that as i say it will be uh, when the progress on the curtain cider and when big parts arrive for the next three trucks so hope that all makes sense and um i'll keep you uh, keep you posted with my madness aka spending problems <laughs> but uh, anyway thank you for watching uh thank you for subscribing as well and um i'll see you in the next video cheers